Hello. Hi. How are you? Welcome. We are going to explain some of the coatings that we did in our class using Scratch and um, Makey Makey. So both of these are science projects that my grade fours did and my grade fives. The grade fours were working on habitats and the grade fives for human body. This is our habitat code. We each researched a different habitat and made dioramas out of clay. We were able to record what we learned and coded so that when you touched our project, our voices played. Here is an example. The coniferous forest. The coniferous forest is cold, but in certain parts can be warm. The trees are close together and block out a lot of sunlight, which we... So each student was able to record their explanation of their um, habitat, and then we could code it all so that it would play when you pressed the button. So our next one... Okay. This is the human body. Each group researched an organ, and we put them together in model of the human body. When you touched each organ, our descriptions were played. So, for example... Hi, I'm Stomach. I'm a J-shaped organ on the left side of your body. When you swallow your food, it goes to me, the stomach. In four so to five hours, able, I will empty again. Oops, each student was completely able to record their own um, little speaking part. Um, I had to make an account in order to save my progress so that we could come back to it later. So looking onto this next tab, um, this I'm going to show you how to make this code. So you go into events and you can click this tab here. And basically it says what key is going to be clicked for your recording to play. So you can start with space, but when you need to have another one, you can change it to any of the other um, keys in order to code it to the Makey Makey. Then in sounds, you click play sound. And right now it's set to meow. Um, but you can now record your own speaking part. So hello. Oops, I have to do it again. Stop recording, re-record. Hello, welcome to my habitat. And then I can save it and change it to greeting. Then in my code, I can change it to the recording that I want. So then the next time I want to add a sound, I can add the recording that I want. Hello. And that is how to do it. I hope you enjoyed our little tutorial. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.